Are you looking for the best tape measures in your budget? Well in today's video we break down the top 5 best tape measures that are available on the market. I made this list based on their price, quality, durability and more. To find out more information about this product, you can check out the description below. And also make sure you subscribe for more reviews. Ok so let's get started with the video. At number 5. Types of Tape Measures When you pull the tape measure out you'll feel a spring that wants to return the tape back to rest. These tapes are usually smaller and can be put in a pocket and typically extend up to 25 feet. The wider the tape, the further you can extend it in the air without it bending and falling to the floor. You can find tapes up to 1 inch in width, but the trade-off is they are larger, heavier, and take up more space. Most spring return tape measures have a metal tip on the end which will move back and forth the width of the tip depending if you're measuring inside or outside an object. Some manufacturers are even adding magnets to hold in place on a metal object. Spring tape measures will be in either imperial or metric and will show typical stud measurements 16 inches on center. At number 4. Yardstick. Most will remember the wood yardstick from childhood classrooms as teachers used them to point to chalkboards. This was an often used, essential measuring tool for classrooms and workshops. At number 3. Carpenter's Folding Ruler. These rulers are a very old and traditional way to make measurements. If you find an old timer and ask him if he has a folding ruler, he may even have a few of them. Today, manufacturers make these folding rulers in either wood or plastic material. The folding style makes them easy to extend and take up less space when not in use. At number 2. Types of Tape Measure Ends. Will you be measuring 2 times 4s for carpentry? Metallic conduit? A variety of use cases? You'll find different types of ends with each one providing pluses and minuses depending on your use case. The most common type of end is the hook which easily hangs onto a board or even a nail for carpentry work. Another type is the ring which is best for attaching to nails, poles, or any long object. Some tapes even have magnets on the end to attach to metal objects which can be useful in certain environments. One point to note is that the width of the hook can make an impact on your measurement increasing just a bit. Manufacturers have compensated by allowing just enough play so that the head moves back and forth its own width. At number 1. Ruler. How many also remember this from school days as a child? This measuring tool is best used to make drawings on paper, read small measurements on drawings, and make straight lines. You'll typically find measurements both in imperial and metric. Most lengths are usually 6, 8, and 12 inches. Thank you for watching guys. I hope you liked this video. If this video was helpful to you, please make sure a like comment and don't forget to subscribe.